Did you know that in one handful of soil, there are more microbes than humans on planet Earth? Microbes are microorganisms like bacteria, fungi, or viruses. Plant biologists like me are studying these microorganisms because they possess great qualities for crop protection and health. These pest-fighting microbes can be found all over the world in nature. We found these microbes on the beaches in the Philippines, in the rainforests of Indonesia, from swamps in Virginia Beach, even in a peach orchard right here in California. This growing field is what we call biologicals. Innovation is making biologicals easier to discover, more targeted, safer, and more effective than ever before. The potential in these tiny microorganisms is really endless. For instance, Bt, or Bacillus thuringiensis, is a microorganism from the soil that a farmer can use to control insects on the crop. One of the reasons why I really like talking about what I do is public awareness of biologicals is still pretty low. Biological tools are very universal. Every farmer can use them. Organic farmers can use them and conventional farmers can use them along with their synthetic counterparts. In our culture collection, we have over 100,000 different microbial strains that are frozen away. Think of it like a giant library. There's always something new to uncover. We identify them, we figure out ways that they may work, we test them, and just like you breed crops over time, we can improve how they actually function. We use fermentation to grow up these microbial strains in a very consistent and controlled way. Using these tanks, we have special recipes when we inoculate the microbe into to the tank, it grows up and multiplies, and then we can harvest the product. Think about the products that you encounter on a daily basis that are based on fermentation, cheese, wine, soy sauce, even chocolate. The biological market is very dynamic and fast growing. Over the past 10 years, it's grown by over 500%. That's 10 times more than the synthetic pesticide market. What's really cool about the biological space is a lot of startup companies are getting involved. It's forecasted that in 2019, 270 million dollars will be spent on research and development. We're really at the tip of the iceberg. There's so much more to uncover. I really think that these biologicals sourced from nature are an incredibly important innovation in agriculture.